Hi folks, G3 here, and welcome to another instalment of my journey to go green. In today's episode, I'm starting to look at deodorant. In the past, I'd used a roll-on deodorant that was in a plastic container with a plastic ball for the roll-on. And I was looking to change that to ensure that it was a plastic free option that I was using. I've looked at a variety of different deodorants. So I've had a little bit of experience of trying different ones. So I know, for example, for this one, where you get a little scoop to use the paste of the deodorant, I found it fairly effective, but my hand was getting messy from applying it. The same with this tin, that it was a hand applied one and it's got a little bit crumbly as it's got towards the end. I've got a number of deodorants I'm gonna be trialing and I'm gonna be finding out how well they work, how long they last. I'm going to look at them over time update a spreadsheet with details like their cost, how effective they were, sort of scent, any issues I had with them, and try and work out a cost per application so we can see which ones are going to be better in the long run. These ones cost about seven pound each from the plasticfreeshop.co.uk, and this one costs 12 pounds. That's quite uh, a lot dearer, but with it, this one lasts a lot longer. There's 75 grams there compared to 60 grams. Perhaps this one has a better lasting effect than this one, so it might make it better value over the long run. We'll find out. I've also got an applicator from Wild and some refills to put in there. So this one works by popping a refill in there using this as the, um, uh, the deodorant case. And there's a number of refills there. Again, this one isn't cheap to buy in the first place, but perhaps it will work out cost effective in the long run, especially if it's very effective. I've been using an old wild deodorant to see what that was like, um, but that was in plastic casing, which was recyclable, but it was in plastic, which is why I've looked to move to their newer version where they're using these cartridges within the holder. I've also got a dry version from Lush, a deodorant bar, so I'll try that and see how that works. And over time, I will add to my research of, of different deodorants, seeing which ones are the best. I will share a Google Doc with the results over time. I'll include a link under the video when that's um, in place, see from my research how things are going, and try and make an educated choice as to what you would like to use. If you've got any comments, then please obviously feed them back to me. Let me know what you've been using, whether there's anything you recommend that I should try what your experience is of using environmentally friendly deodorants. So they're in packaging that is recyclable. Obviously a number of these deodorants are also have the benefit of being vegan. This earth conscious one is not tested on animals and it's vegan approved. I'll also make a note of that within the notes so that we can see which ones are uh, approved for, for vegans as well. But that's it folks. That's what I'm gonna be looking at. It's just a quick introduction to let you know that are gonna be looking at this over time. I will be starting soon to record these videos. They're gonna take some time to record because I'm gonna look at these each in turn and I want to try them over a little period of time. So I need to make sure that they can cope with general day-to-day -day use. How do they cope when I'm playing sports? And, and really just how do they cope with life? So it's gonna take a little while to get this information down, but I will be collating that and sharing that with you over time. Now obviously, so you don't miss any of those, why don't you subscribe to the channel and click the bell icon so you get notified when I load up a new video? Because this is going to be done over time, so you're going to want to follow that and see how I get on with them. So thanks for watching, folks. If you enjoyed this, then please click the like button down below. And thanks for watching. Until next time, bye.